In this video, I want to show you ways of getting more Facebook fans. Now, basically, there are two ways of getting more Facebook fans. You can either grow your following organically, or you can buy advertising that um, promotes your Facebook page. Now, let's talk about how you can grow your following organically, because that's probably the best way of doing so, but certainly the cheapest. And of course, the best way to grow more Facebook fans is to give them a reason to visit your Facebook page. And basically, that means posting useful, interesting content. And if you post stuff your target audience wants to read, they will, first of all, read it. They'll like it. They'll follow you so they can read more of it. And they'll tell others who might be interested too. So you'll grow your fan base that way. When you're posting content, it's always a good idea to post a picture or a GIF alongside your post. And it makes it more eye-catching and interesting. And if possible, you should post an original picture if you have one, preferably one that ties into the content of, of the page and perhaps shows you uh, in it as well, because then it basically cements it and ties it all together. You should also have share buttons on your website or on your blog. And this can encourage people to like, share and follow you on Facebook. You should also interact with the comments and respond. You know, don't just simply post up your Facebook page and then go away and don't come back until you're starting something else. You know, join in the conversation. Be a part of the community. Make sure that people know that you're going to interact with them uh, if they post a comment uh, on your Facebook page. And you can also use other social media to promote your page. You know, things like YouTube, Twitter, Pinterest, Reddit, etc. You can all link them together so that they go back to your Facebook page. In fact, if you're posting a video on YouTube, this is actually very easy because you can simply put something at the end that says follow us on Facebook and gives the URL. So it is actually quite easy to do it that way. The other way that you can get more Facebook fans is by purchasing advertising so that it leads people to your page who perhaps wouldn't stumble upon it organically. Now, Facebook ads, which is what the uh, system is on Facebook, work in a similar way to Google AdWords. In other words, they're PPC or pay-per-click. But unlike Google AdWords, they're more varied and they can be more tightly targeted. For example, you can target people by their age, gender, location, interests, marital status, etc., etc. Now let's look at the different types of ad that you can have on Facebook. There used to be all sorts of different types, but now they whittled it down to just a few. And I suppose the most popular one is the promoted post. And the supported placements for that are in the right column, mobile feed and news feed. And this is a great way of getting a larger audience engaged with an important piece of content or promotion. And for a set budget, you can boost a post which will increase its visibility in the feed of people who like your page as well as their friends. So again, it's going to get them right in front of the post that you want them to read. Then there's the boosted post, which is slightly different. And its supported placements are right column, mobile feed, and news feed as well. And it's available to pages with 50 likes or more. And it's basically a simpler version of promoted posts. And you can choose fans of your page and their friends, or you can choose to select by targeting criteria. Then there's a domain ad. And the supported placement for this is the right column. And domain ads are essentially adverts that appear in the sidebar and point directly to a website that you're hosting. So you can go straight to your website. And these are perhaps the simplest form of ads and are composed of a simple heading and a block of text. And it's a bit like Google AdSense, if you're familiar with uh, that type of advertising, AdWords, AdSense. Then there's the multi-product. 
and this is placed in the news feed and the mobile news feed. And multi product ads, as you would expect, display multiple items on a slideshow type display that lets users browse and shop right from Facebook. And this is incredibly powerful for e commerce stores, and it means you're really only posting one ad to promote a whole range of products. Then there's the page like, and this supported placement for so this one is the right column newsfeed and mobile newsfeed. And this is an advert for your Facebook page, essentially. And with these, you're trying to increase your number of likes so that you can generate a bigger audience to market to. Then there are video ads, and the supported placements are the right column, newsfeed, and mobile newsfeed. And video ads let you showcase a video. And these are good for getting likes, and they're powerful for video marketing. Then there are app ads and the supported placements are the right column and the news feed. And if you have built a branded app for Facebook, then this is how you can promote it and encourage downloads. Then there's an event ad. Now, these are in the right column, news feed and mobile news feed. And they, as the name would imply, allow you to advertise events. And this can be useful for increasing interest for a company launch event, for instance, or a conference, or if you've got a bricks and mortar store and you're running a special event or a promotion, then you can use this uh, to tell people about it. And finally, there's an offer. And the supported placements are the right column, newsfeed, and mobile newsfeed. And an offer advert is useful for companies who want to market a special offer. And anyone who clicks on your ad will be emailed a code that they can use in order to redeem your special offer. And you know, this is great for encouraging sales. And all of these different ways will help you to build your fan base. Because even if it's something like an offer ad, people are going to know about your Facebook page and you can encourage them to like you and follow you and so on. So this is just a few ways that you can build your Facebook following, build your Facebook fan base.